I'm feeling really good right now. I mean, we're one of the top two teams in the conference, and that just shows that we're okay with pushing. And like Ruggles said in the thing, we have nine batters. Some of us fizzle. Some of us really show up, and that's a hard lineup to get through. So we really showed up tonight. Uh, talk about your night in the circle overall. Looked like you were moving the ball around and, and did a pretty good job of hitting spots. What, what was working for you tonight? Honestly, everything was working tonight. Um, I'm really working on new pitches right now. I'm not going to say those because I don't want anyone to like know those. But um, no, normally I rely on my changeup, and I didn't have to rely on that tonight, so it was really nice. Yeah. Uh, what about on offense? Uh, talk about the home run. Looked like you, you dropped the bad head, and that, that ball got out of here. Yeah, um, Coach Carly, she's our new coach this year. I love her to death. But um, she told me my first at bat when I struck out, I was late on it. So then I took some extra things out that I didn't need, and I just crushed the ball because I had to do it. All right, uh, Rachel, your night, uh, you collect a couple hits at the, at the plate. Uh, talk about hitting off TJ Stokes. Uh, she can throw pretty hard. How were you able to catch up? Um, she's a great pitcher. She is a great POI pitcher, and it's good to come out and compete against that. And I just think tonight was a good night for me, and as the team as a whole, honestly, it was, it was a good night for us. Uh, your team hits uh, over 400 uh, on the season. You have 11, 11 hits as a team tonight. What, what about this offense is so difficult? It looks like one through nine, everybody can hit. Yeah, like Lina said, it's just one through nine. Somebody has it up, somebody has it down, you know. But we all just even each other out in the end, and that's what's great about us. What about goals for this team? Uh, you're nine and one at this point. Where do you think this team could go? Um, you know, well, a goal is always to get back to where we were last year, and if we get there, that's great. And we just keep on working towards that, and we'll take it from there. Good. Absolutely. Um, you know, when we came up here tonight, we knew they were going to be really good. The Stokes girl's fantastic. She does not miss her spots. Um, she has that rise ball that's just so hard to get a hold of. I thought our girls were aggressive early in the count. That was kind of our goal coming in was to be early in the count, try to go after the first pitch, if not the second pitch right away. Thought we did a pretty good job of that. Um, we had a couple times where we missed that first pitch. That puts us in a bad position. That's where that drop ball can come in, and then she starts climbing that ladder with that rise ball. And boy, she's tough when she can do that. Uh, talk about the effort from, from Caroline in the circle. Uh, she she held him down all night and and really was uh, was around the zone all night too. You know we've always talked about Caroline is competitively wild. Uh, it seems like she's never she's always an 0-2 count and she'll work her way to a 3-2 count. Um, but she puts them away. Um, she has a great job. I don't think batters can ever really square her up. Uh, a couple times Lennox actually did have some really nice hits tonight. One down right field and one down left field. I was actually pretty impressed with. But they just don't seem to square her up really all that well consistently all night long. So yeah, her her effort tonight has been very good. She's been fighting a little arm issue after the AAU season, but she's actually getting ice now. She's getting recovery. She's done a really nice job. Been very happy with her recovery and she's getting better and better every night. Uh, you scored five runs tonight. I think you left 11 runners on, on base. So maybe one thing to take away is try to cash in a few more runs. You know, in, in our league too, if you could put runners on every single inning and just keep pounding and just keep pounding and hope that something will kindly go through, you're right. That'll be a big uh, emphasis. And we did that last night with Earlham too. Earlham, we had a couple of times where I thought we had runners in scoring positions, some situational hitting. We felt like we were trying to hit too much power. Uh, sometimes just a little blooper to right center or a little play in the right center scores two runs. A base hit would be a lot better than maybe a double. But yes. Yeah, some situational hitting will be one thing. Thought Rachel Sabaka played extremely well tonight. Thought Sam Stewart was fantastic on the bases tonight. That girl was ornery all night long. She had delayed steals. She stole a couple bases. She kept agging me at third base so she could steal home. She felt like she could even get there. So uh, she's aggressive. Uh, we like that in our runners. We have that freelance ability for our runners to read that and go. Thought we did really well with that all night.